on YouTube. This is me, Janae. I want to thank you so much for stopping by my channel and taking out your time to watch my video. Uh, today's video will be a sweater uh, type of haul because it is now sweater season. So I have a few sweaters that I would like to share with you. I got all of the sweaters from, um, all of the sweaters came from Ashley Stork. I just want you to sit back, relax, kick your feet up, grab you something nice and warm to drink because today here in Jersey it is a kind of cloudy day, a little a little on the chilly side, so get that hot cocoa, get that coffee, cappuccino, whatever it is that you're drinking. Kick your feet up, sit back, relax. And while you're doing that and while you're waiting for that video to start, I want you to stop by, hit that post notification bell so that you will be notified every time I post a video. Hit that subscribe button so that you will know every time there's something new going on with me and Janae. Okay, so I, now that that is out of the way, we're gonna jump right into the haul. I won't be with you long because I do know that some attention spans are shorter than others, so I'm gonna try to keep this video as short and sweet as possible. So sit right there and I'll be right back. So I am back and I do have on this nice, lovely, lovely sweater. It's, um, a, it's a, actually a white sweater, like a three, almost like a three quarter length sleeve kind of plain and I do actually forgive me I am filming in a different look a different room today I'm not gonna say location because I am at home but I'm in a different room so I'm trying to see what works best for my videos but this is a nice white sweater it's actually really really kind of a, a plain sweater but it's what you do with it that would make it really really nice what drew me to the sweater a lot though I am gonna show you it is this back detailing it's like a um almost like a crisscross kind of it has kind of a uh corset effect, uh, effect that you can make it tighter or as loose as you would like i do have this sweater um in a 14 16 it's nice and roomy it does give me a lot of room it gives me a lot of give to the sweater um like it's really not much to say about the sweater but it is a nice nice sweater it is very warm it is a very soft cotton material um it's just i really just like it i'm gonna step back a little further uh so that you can possibly see a little bit mo uh, more of the sweater so it does come down it stops maybe mid but <laughs> So I, I had to sit on my tippy toes because I'm only 5'4 and me and this camera thing is um it's getting a, a, a crazy angle for me. But anyway, needless to say, the sweater does come down about waist length, so it stops about mid butt, but it's it's a very, very nice fit. It's a very, very um comfortable sweater. Sometimes you have sweaters and they're a little itchy or they're a little rough. It's a very soft sweater. Again, it is white, so it's very plain, but it is what you do with the sweater. I'm just trying to, I'm looking around in my room to see. I thought I had a piece of jewelry that I could grab real quick just to kind of, okay. I have this little necklace here. So if you add like a piece of, like a statement piece or something, you know, just to bring the sweater out, it won't be, you know, just a plain sweater. It is what you make it you can do like i stated in a previous video some like black pieces and white pieces are just foundational pieces you build on top of that so it is all in how you build on top of the outfit that you're wearing so again this is the sweater from right here again like i stated the back is my most favorite part of the sweater because of the detail and the design this side here and that's the whole 360 view. Um, now I'm gonna apologize now because I wish the video could be vertical, <laughs> vertical and not horizontal. <laughs> but we're gonna get through it and stay tuned for my next try on. And welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. So the next piece I have is this nice black um, sweater. I love the detailing on the sweater. Um, it's just, it was just something different, something just unique about it that it's like a, um, if I can get a little closer, maybe you can see, it's like a little beaded 
and they're kind of like a gold and a uh, silver type detail on this black sweater, which gives it an extra little flare, extra little something. It comes down on both sleeves, about to elbow length on both sides. It almost, truthfully speaking, it almost reminds me of wings, which would actually go in the back, but this is the front of the shirt. But it almost reminds me of like a like some like feathers of a wing, and I I like it. Um, again, this is not a long sleeve. It is about this is probably more of a three quarter length. The other one was anyway, but like it's really short length. It's um a little more hugged and fitted than the previous sweater. This is feels more like a um not so much like a the other sweater was like a cotton feel. This is more apparently like, like a polyester polyester stretch, but it's a really nice, um, almost like a curvature bodycon type of sweater. Uh, again, it's it's really nice. I'm sorry, my windows are open, and someone anyway. So it's it's a really nice fit. I'm gonna turn around. I'm gonna have to. Sorry, guys. I'm gonna have to pull you down just a little bit so that you can see the back of this sweater and again this side my back up a little bit this is where the sweater stops it stops again right right a little bit under the waist well my waist is here so the sweater stops about here and I'm gonna turn around for you and I, I really like the sweater um I think it's a really nice fit uh, again, like I stated, I do have this in a 14-16, um, but it, hmm, it's a it's stretch to it. Possibly, it would be okay if you wore a 16-18 to, to be able to, to fit this because it does have stretch, but again, you don't want the, sometimes the sweater stretch so much that you start to see like the, um, like the see-through in between, and you really don't want that, but if you wore... Uh, uh, 18 you could definitely get into this um, with no problem with you know it won't it wouldn't be too tight the arms again like I stated they are it, it is like a um, uh, what I, want, I don't want to say constricting because it's not tight it's just it's form-fitting that's the word I'm looking for it's, it's like a form-fitting sweater so you shouldn't have any problems with the arms again I don't have um, rather large arms I, I mean they are you know but they're not you know so you shouldn't have any problem with that like I said it does have a lot of give to the sweater so again if you are 18 you would be able to wear this 14 16 pretty comfortably um other than that I the sweater is just it's just a nice sweater it's really really nice sweater by Ashley stores so I'm going to get to the next sweater. Stay right there and I'll be right back. So welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, because you may be watching for your wives to get them a nice sweater for Christmas. <laughs> so I am back with this lovely little, um, I don't know why we say lovely little, but with this lovely pink sweater. Um, this sweater is uh, cotton. Again, this is a long sleeve sweater. It does come all the way down to my wrist. Um, it's has like a little, I don't like little details made within the sweater. I got this sweater in a um, 1820. I don't know why, because the shoulder part of the sweater keeps falling down. I don't know if the 1416s were sold out. Anyway, that's neither here nor there. We're here to talk about the sweater. So let's talk about the sweater. But it, it's a very nice, soft sweater. Like I said, it is uh, cotton. Um, again, this sweater also hits just like the other sweater hit, uh, right? Maybe it feels about maybe three inches below the waist, right in the middle of the backside. I'm going to turn to the side. You see, see if I can do a tiptoe thing. This is the back. This is the side. And... We're back to the 360 view of the sweater. Again, um, this is like a, it's more of, of like a hot, no, not hot, maybe like a fuchsia. I don't know if it's coming across that way 
on um on the on the camera but it's more like a fuchsia color um to this sweater it has almost like it's not such a round collar but it's not a square collar either i i really don't know how to explain the collar but it is it's nice it's not it's not um too hot it's very warm though uh, and then maybe I'm I'm a little warm because I'm in a closed space. But it's it's really, really comfortable. It's really nice. Um, like I stated with the previous piece, you could sweaters are just easy anyway. I'm I'm just gonna say sweaters are easy. You could either you can always dress a sweater up or dress a sweater down. Like throw this on with a pair of jeans or a jean skirt or you know, something khaki. Depending on the color, okay, but whatever. Um, and some boots, and you're kind of like um, really, really casual. You could throw the sweater on again with some nice um, work pants or a nice skirt, nice jewelry, and change the whole look of the outfit. And you're more of of have a dressy feel to it. Um, but other than that, that's about all I can say for this sweater. It's not much to it. It's a regular plain sweater. Um, be consistent. Um, again, this is the oops, this is the side. You can see it. This is the back. This is this side. Almost fell. And this is the front one back to the 360 view. And I have one more sweater to try on, and that would be the end of my haul. So don't go nowhere. Thank you for liking and thank you for staying this far. If you made it this far, throw some, throw some pink hearts. It should be some, it should be pink, right? Yeah, throw some pink hearts in the comment section, okay? Thank you. I'll be right back. And welcome back to my last and final try on. This, uh, this piece here, again, this is a long sleeve uh, sweater. This piece caught my eye because I like the color detail in it. I'm not sure if you can... If it's really coming across, mm. I'll let you know. It's um, pink, yellow, black, and like a turquoise. And the little silver specks remind me of... Um, <laughs> it reminds me of tinsel <laughs> on a Christmas tree. Um, but it's such a, it's such a pretty sweater. Um, I got this in a, a, um, 1820. Again, I don't know why I got an 18, but I could have gotten it in 1416 because this it's again very roomy. It has a lot of stretch, a lot of give. Um, again, like the other sweaters, it hits me maybe about two inches or so under my waistline. But it's a really pretty sweater. I wish I wish you could see it the way I see it. Let me see if I could do that I don't want to mm, maybe not as much but again it's really really nice now I will say with this sweater I guess because of I'm gonna call it tinsel I guess because of the the fabric of the sweater it is a little itchy so I would suggest to wear maybe like a, um either a tank top under it or or you could wear a long sleeve shirt under it if you don't if you don't you know if you're one that doesn't overheat but to to keep your skin from possibly being irritated you know i don't know you know if you have sensitive skin or not but you could wear like a long sleeve shirt so that you wouldn't get that itch effect at all um i don't have sensitive skin i do have on a tank top under here but it i you could feel the itchiness of the sweater maybe around here and maybe on this arm this arm doesn't feel i don't know why but again i like i really like the sweater it's not gonna stop me from wearing the sweater no um with this sweater you could do like i said it before i'm so i'm looking at the mirror as well sorry but with this sweater you could do a lot with it uh again like i said it sweaters are versatile you can dress them up you can dress them down still with some cute you know cute boots because it is boot season as well and if you haven't seen my last video i did a 
boot try on haul. Go check that out. Support your girl. I need it. <laughs> but I mean, you could switch your boots up to, you know, kind of coordinate with your outfit to, to dress it up or dress it down as much as you like. Again, this is my last piece for today's try on. I want to thank you all for staying. I want to thank you all for watching. And if you made it this far, high five. I thank you and I appreciate it. And if you're not following me, follow me on Instagram. My Instagram name is I am Mia J A underscore N E T. I'll post it somewhere here or over here. And that'd be I M M I A J A underscore N E T. Again, like I stated earlier, I thank you so much for staying. I thank you so much for watching. Comment in the uh, comment section. Let me know what you think about the video. Let me know what you want to see more of and what you want to see less of. Uh, let me know if you want some, some more story time. I did do a story time video. Check that out as well. Uh, but let me know if you want to see some story time, some blogs, some vlogs. Let me know. Let's chit chat. Let's talk. Let's converse. Because I want Mia Janae's channel to grow. We're, we are growing. We are going to grow because we're going somewhere. And I want you to come along with me. I want you to be a part of the journey. It's like they always say, take somebody with you. It's enough room for all of us to win. So like I stated again, well, like I stated before, I'm going to state again. Thank you so much for staying. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, bye lovelies. Peace.